So Wes, uh, you've been uh, traveling the globe with your sister all over the place, seeing athletes, the best uh, runners in the world, um, compete and try to train and all that type of stuff. So what are some things you've seen that you would uh, share with aspiring athletes to make sure that they can be healthy and have a, the longest type of career they can have possible? Yeah, I think one of the main things is just really making sure that, that you have a solid team around you, um, that you have a go-to person when when you're feeling anything in your body or when you're not, when you're just ready, when you just need to like continue having um, having that consistent treatment. So I think a lot of athletes, they don't know where to go or um, who they should look to when, not even when anything's wrong, but just like when things are okay, how do they take care of their body? They don't know where to go. And so if you can make that a priority of finding who that person's gonna be, who those people are gonna be, I think you're gonna be in a much better, much better situation. So, uh, how do? You, what's the best way you think to kick the tires on that to find out who somebody who's good and who's not? Yeah, good? You know I mean, saying? I think there's you know as an athlete, there are the people who were before you. So you can look to them and say, you know, who did you work with? You seem like you had a solid career. You didn't get injured too much. Who did you work with? Um, I think a lot of times it's going to be. Uh, location based so if you live in a certain city you've got to find somebody who's in that city so look to those local athletes and see who do they work with um, and start there yeah, yeah. And, uh, obviously your sister is a legend and uh, she has the means and the ability to have somebody consistent and travel with her right mm -hmm. so what would you say to somebody who uh, should they have somebody travel with them inspired? yeah I think or if you're think? if you're able to have someone travel yeah, with yeah. you I think that that's great because you can have someone who knows your body so you're not getting there and explaining what your problems are and then trying to have someone, you know, give you treatment for those. You can have someone who knows exactly what's going on, knows what you need, knows how your body reacts. Um, I think you can have times when, you know, you can tell someone don't go that deep and they go a little bit too deep and now you're sore the next two days versus having that person who, who knows your body really gets you and they already know exactly what you need. So if you can, I think that's great, but if not, it's still important to get the treatment either way.